my head! And I'm sometimes wet! I stand tall and proud and smell like low tide! What am I? I don't know. An old lighthouse, maybe? Wrong! It's my dick! Oh, brother. <laughs> so you aren't Navis from the planet Pandora? Navis are so 2009. So 2009. You mean so 2011. <laughs> my god, I so don't give a fuck about Navis. Hashtag lame. Oh, snap. Excuse me, but let's get back on task. What exactly do you need, sir? I don't know. <sighs> oh my god, like hashtag WTF. Terry Richardson just followed me. Terry Richardson? Shake my head like deja vu. Hashtag can't even. In W Magazine, there was this I don't know what's happening to me, but I want to smash some little blue people. I know I'm going to crash something. And sometimes I can be slippery. All right, let's stop with the riddles, because honestly, I don't have much time. Me neither. Me neither. Hey, check it, sweetie. Did you see the Facebook post about the Amazonian tribe that's getting pillaged by capitalists and the army? I don't give a fuck about the Amazon. And Facebook sucks anyway. You need to be on classmates.com, dude. Oh, fuck. Classmates? Hashtag not my classmates mom. Classmates.com? It's next level irony. Mulder, say hi to the nice lady. No. Just say hello. She's here to help you. No, she's going to scan my brain. No, Mulder, she isn't going to scan your brain. You're not going to scan his brain, are you? No, I wouldn't even know how. See? She's lying! <laughs> uh, can you tell me your name, please, miss? Sandy. Just Sandy. <laughs> okay, so it says here you were sent back to the orphanage. Can you tell me why? No idea, ma'am. I had the highest grades in the whole school. All right, let's see. Uh, your case file shows a report regarding a lewd behavior. Okay, I admit it. I got caught smoking a cigar. A cigar. Uh, uh. Okay, well, let me remind you that uh, smoking can be hazardous to your health. Oh, yes. It's very bad. <laughs> All right, then. We're FBI, which is supposed to be badass, but all we get are these shit cases involving rednecks who all claim they were kidnapped by little green men. Gray! And the technical term is abducted, not kidnapped! If you say so. Go ahead, what am I thinking, huh? Huh? <laughs> I got you, you fucking alien! <laughs> oh, it wasn't the first time, you know. Usually I would get spanked a few times as punishment for being bad. I had to get down on my knees and take off my panties and she'd spank me. Oh, she'd spank me. It was all very upsetting. <laughs> of course it was. But this hotel for 40 years and I've never had any problems until last night. Oh, tell me what happened. <laughs> I was at my post at the elevator when he entered in his bathrobe. The way he stared at me, it was as if I was... <gasps> A piece of meat. <laughs> okay, okay, and then? He says fifth floor, but I knew exactly what he wanted. So I got undressed and I got down on all fours. They let him have his way with me. <laughs> oh, uh, all right, but, but did he touch oh, you? Oh, oh, that stare. His eyes penetrated me. My innocence had been violated. <laughs> yes, but what are you expecting from him? I, I don't understand. Oh, nothing can restore my honor. Do you hear me? No! Of course, it's possible that a modest settlement could help me get on with my life. It's just that I have a squirrel to feed, and this man is rich. What's four million dollars to him anyway, huh? Mm -hmm, <laughs> I see, yes. But this man, he stole my innocence and virtue! <laughs> oh, jeez, what happened to your hair? You tummy sonda! So you got into another fight, yeah? You come my soba! Will Vegeta be able to fix Son Dooku's blowout before the big tournament? Or is all hope lost? I am Nerdy Snurf, president of the LMOSWTGO, the liberation movement of oppressed Snurfs who wish to desperately get out. Wish to get out of what exactly? Out of the Snurf village, of course. We're sick to death of eating raspberries and running around singing la 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 Oh my god, I hate that we song. We get pinched out if we don't snurf our hats at exactly a 45 degree angle, thanks a lot. Huh. And the punishments? I can tell you the Grand Snurf has some imagination, that old perp. So it's kind of like a cult and the Grand Snurf is is like a cult leader, a guru of some sort? Hell yeah, a guru who snurfs us all by the ball! What have you got against Luke? He doesn't visit that often and it makes me happy. And he's my brother! 
Come on, Daddy. Don't you like it when Luke comes to visit us? Don't treat me like an idiot. It's not by accident that Blondie only shows up when I'm not there. He's a Jedi Knight. It's complicated. Well, next time, Jedi or no Jedi, I'll say hello with my fist in his fucking face! <laughs> right on. Let's burn these symbols of fascist oppression! Yeah. Right on. And vow that never again will we follow false prophets! Totally! Preach, brother. Because the only prophet is Jesus! Hallelujah! <laughs> Okay, it's true. We kissed once. Satisfied? Is that another Jedi thing? I guess it's cultural, like the Mormons or whatever. And what if I told you it was to make you jealous? Hmm? Ah, then bravo! It just keeps getting better. Maybe you should write a book. How mm. to find true love by sucking face with your brother. Mm. I am... Old, you old fuck. <laughs> Hold on. I'm with the assholes. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming. Mm -hmm. See you Jedis later. May the Force and all that shit be with you. Peace out. <laughs> La la boof la 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 boof la 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 boof la 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 This caseworker, what a story! I have been getting anonymous letters for quite a while now, and they all say some really nasty things. They are giving me boo-boos on my gentle monster heart. Ah yes, these letters aren't very nice. Okay, Mr. Moda, tell me a little more about this extraterrestrial problem. Oh, you ask an awful lot of questions, don't you, miss? It's normal. It's her job, Mulder. Back off, Mother Skelly! It's all because of my Facebook page. There are a lot of pictures of me playing with my sweet little fans, and they said some pretty harsh things. But it's perfectly normal for a friend of children to be friends with children, right? Mm, he didn't take his meds today. Oh, so. Listen, ma'am, I'm a sweet, gentle monster. Sweet monsters are very cuddly. In the old days on my island, it was just like this, and everyone was always happy. I hear what you're saying. Mm. However, I have a letter in which they use the term molested. Molested? That's ridiculous. They were just cuddles. Big, squishy cuddles. <laughs> Analysis complete, results negative. It's cool, she's one of us. Sorry, ma'am, but you can't be too careful. Can I get my pen now? Here. Thanks, Mother Skelly. I'm not your mother, so stop with that. Okay, Mother Skelly. What? If I ever get abducted by aliens, promise me that... You'll what? What's that on your glasses there? Hmm? You're filming me, aren't you? Last week you told me you were chipmunks, but apparently you are no longer chipmunks. Well, actually, we're from the planet Pandora, and we're Navis. Your Navi what? You know, like the documentary by the dude who made Titanic? Oh, I didn't see it. Hey, what is he doing to my phone? Just chill, all right? I'm communicating with nature over here. I'm all the way down with nature. Oh, hell yeah. Sweet. <laughs> Miss Sandy, I see that a restraining order has been filed against you what? by a certain Prince Charming. <gasps> I believe it was filed for harassment. Seriously? For harassment? You must be joking! He's the one harassing me. Walking around in those tight leggings, taunting me with that sexy little ass on those full wet lips. Oh, oh. And I'm harassing him? It's so unfair. Hmm, it's weird. I thought the Navi were much taller. What, so now all Navi have to be like 10 feet tall? That's discrimination against little people, miss. And, and you need to be careful. What's my bad? I'm feeling an intense pain. <laughs> We've known each other for a while, and you know so much about me, but I know nothing about you. But that's the nature of my job, dear. It must be hard dealing with other people's problems every day. Relax. How about having a drink with me? Yeah, no, I'm good, thanks. Oh, oh please, my mother gave me that pen for my first holy communion. I mean, you're very nice, but... Is there anyone else in the family who might be able to help? I don't know, a sister or a brother, maybe? Yes, but, uh, my brother is a special case. It's been years since they've spoken. No shit, this guy freaked and ripped his hand off last mm. time. <laughs> I am your father! Okay, Pop, thanks for sharing that crucial bit of information with us. Now shut the fuck up, Mommy and Daddy are talking. <laughs> Excuse me, where is Miss Smith? Uh, nothing against you, it's just that she's my usual social worker. Unfortunately, Miss Smith has had some financial woes, and so she's taking on a new job. Poor dear. Oh, shit. This financial crisis has been a dark time for everyone. Uh, no offense, man. Uh, excuse me? When I say dark, I don't mean you. It's just that when we say dark, it means that, uh, it's Hold a dark on. time. What are you trying to say here? Jeez, you can't say anything. I mean, slavery was awful. Cotton fields and whatever, but what- Can we move on? I wasn't even there. Sheesh. Man, this is just unbearable. 
This bullshit armor is like taking apart IKEA furniture without the instructions. It's worse. Oh, sorry. It's my turn to change him. See? See what I'm dealing with. I've been hit by discrimination, too. What I mean is, I was holding down a steady job for years. When overnight, what happens? I get replaced by... Ha! A Negro rabbit! Careful there, sir. It's insulting. Watch it. I'm not fooling. What? Now you have rabbits in your family? I am your... You're a disgusting mess, that's what you are. How about using the force to try to control your own sphincter for a change? Stop it, dear! <laughs> Giles, this is not good. It says here you hit a young woman in the street in front of a whole crowd and knocked her out. Yeah, I know it sounds bad, sure. I mean, you're looking at a charge of assault with intent to do bodily harm. No way! It was an accident! Shit! All right, so I was running a little late to meet Chun Lee at the corner of Wilshire and Santa Monica Boulevard, right across from Mr. Chow's, okay? Now, I'm running and I'll say her, so I throw a sonic boom right in her face, okay? No more teeth for her, right? So then I low kick, low kick, bicycle kick, okay? And she doesn't even block and shit. And that's when I started out uh, having second thoughts, you know? I understand you're just getting back from a long trip. Oh, yes, it was quite a difficult ordeal for the two of us, finding ourselves stranded all alone on that island for so many years. Yes, I understand. And now we'll both get back to our lives. You'll go back to your wife and your children. I guess we'll just go our separate ways. You can always come over for dinner now and then if you want. Oh, I don't know about that. With your wife, it might be awkward. After what happened. Damn it, Wilson! We said we'd never talk about that! All right, okay! What happened on the island stays on the island. I don't want to hear about it! Well, you can't say you didn't enjoy it. Hold on! Just listen! How the hell was I supposed to know? A lot of my street-fighting colleagues have the tendency to dress like hookers! It's all very simple. I see an Asian woman with a camel toe. I don't want to ask questions. It's like Sonic Boom, man. <laughs> It turns out she actually was a Chinese prostitute. The resemblance was really striking, you know. So, I see you didn't return to the Snuff Village after all. Absolutely not. Cults are for the weak-minded. Check her out! Check her out! She's so hot! Look here, you can even see her push! Shut up, I'm almost there! I'm gonna fuck her right between the feathers! Biatch! Yeah. What are you watching there, little ducklings, eh? Last night we filmed Aunt Daisy while she was in the shower, just like Mission Impossible! Do you wanna see? <laughs> ah, still evolving. Oh shit, it's out of duck! Yo, what up? And yet again. <laughs> Another conversion? This is insane. What's next? Listen, Unc, you gotta stop fucking around and get rid of that loser accent, all right? You can't understand shit! Yeah, how are we supposed to get respect when our uncle sounds like he's sucking a dick when he talks? Hey, my name is Donald. Uh, quack, quack. I can't talk. I got a dick in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you snurfs are going to have to make up your minds at some point. That tickles. We have your basic Stonehenge monolith. That's a classic one. And, uh, well, yes, you can see yes, it's very model. nice. But let's get back to the cart accident, shall we? Ooh, whatever. Okay, then, all right. Obeselix and I were pushing the cart along, just chilling and shit, when all of a sudden, out of nowhere, bam, this Roman dude slams right into us with his Yeah, car. okay, but weren't you under the influence of alcohol during this accident? Say what? Excuse me, but I have never. I mean, I've never. No, no, no. I mean, I, we just had a little bit of our magical morning pick me up, like we always do. <laughs> I got fired, and I'm not ashamed of it, but I will bounce back, trust me, because no job, no dignity, am I right? So I made up my mind to grab the bull by the horns and start doing my own thing. Ah, like a self-starting entrepreneur. Exactly, I'm an entrepreneur. Actually, I've been doing this for the past two weeks now, and I think it's off to a pretty good start. May I show you? Sure. Great, give me a minute. <coughs> Here we go. Oh, please! Mr. Spare some change. I need something to hit. I can't... <laughs> Why the hell are they always after us to pee in the cups all the time? <gasps> okay, okay, calm down. Anyway, we were wondering, like, could you do us a little favor? <gasps> Can we get some of your pee? What do you say? Some pee pee. Hello, darkness, my amigo. Give me money, help my ego. Oh, you <laughs> have to calm <laughs> down. Step back. Don't come any closer. Get back. Easy, Mulder. <laughs> easy. We're breathing calmly. No, you, don't. you can't catch me. You can't catch me. 
It's about our son. He isn't doing very well. I'm so afraid that he's heading straight for the dark side. Oh, for fuck's sake, let the kid have some fun. Ever since he was a little boy, you've been smothering him. The Force, the Force. Well, take a look at the Force. <laughs> Here's your Force right here. <laughs> I am. About two seconds away from me knocking your tired old ass into a black hole. I would like to apologize. Clearly, I have not been myself. I was overworked, but I'm doing much better now. So no more little green men? Great. <laughs> anyway, uh, yes, that's right. The Plutonians and the Martians, none of them exist at all. So I would like to thank you for your help, and also, <laughs> Skelly, to whom I am in no way related whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, time for your pill, Mulder. Uh, that's right, it's been 15 minutes. <laughs> you have any water? Oh, look at my boy. Isn't the boy handsome? Isn't he built to become a real space pirate? Look at him! Happy, John Paul? Say you're happy. Well, all right, he has a slight speech impediment. <laughs> you're not his father! <laughs> Excuse me, sir, but smoking is not allowed in this establishment. Fuck off. Mm, so how are things going with your addiction issues? Oh, I get it because it is us there are issues. How dare I? Who dare? Who dare you? Ah, fuck it. That potion you guys drink, just between us, it has alcohol in it, doesn't it? No, nothing, nothing to do with alcohol. Yeah. We are talking about body, about the complexity, about aroma. Okay, regarding the incident, can we get back to that, please? Us cops have dangerous jobs. We have to make decisions very quickly. All right, so you decided to act. Right. Uh, upon this woman. Yeah. A woman who was only jaywalking. Dirty scum. Mm -hmm. And it was at that point you decided to. <laughs> go, go, gadget, brass knuckles in her fucking face. Simple. Uh, but this lady was 88 years old. Overkill, maybe? It's easy to rewrite history after the battle. But that's just what the streets are like, a fucking battlefield! <laughs> I admitted this shit will put some hell on your chest. You also mention a shoplifting incident, is that right? Yeah, in this situation, I just followed the standard protocol. Yeah. Go, go, gadget head, but to the nose. Hey, yeah. Go, go, gadget karate kick right in the choppers. About little Jeremy, uh, who would have been seven years old next week? Kid lifted at least 10 bucks with a chocolate. <laughs> I cooled him out. Links? Hello, Hello ma'am. I hear your uncle finally got a job. That's great news. Yeah, and we're going to move, and we make lots of new <laughs> friends. Awesome. So, where are you kids moving to? I need to have that information. To the city of Hawaiian Gardens. <laughs> with lots of flowers. It's gonna be so pretty. Yeah, come on, let's go. Wait, isn't Hawaiian Gardens mostly housing projects? Bye, -bye miss. Oh, uh, you, your father is breathing pretty hard there. Are you sure he's okay? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's normal. No, oh, sure, if sounding like a broken vacuum cleaner is normal. Stop it, dear. Wait, what happened, little ducklings? You don't look so good. Are you all right? <laughs> Fifteen years with this old goat. Fifteen years of him taking up space, and I can't deal with it. Yeah. Couldn't we at least think about, uh, nursing home, maybe? That's out of the question! He's my father. I am your father. Yeah, we know. Listen to me, babe. Let's face the facts here. He'll love it there. He'll be just fine. I am your father. Yeah, we got it the first 684 times you said it. Knock it off, you old fart, or I'll knock you off! Darling, stop it! I'm... Well, it sure looks like you've adapted to your new neighborhood pretty well. And why the fuck wouldn't we? Just because we're dogs, we're supposed to be losers, is that it? Yeah. Right. Obviously not. Hey! No fucking telekinesis! No Ooh. telekinesis at home! No telekinesis around gas! Listen to me! When your big gorilla friend comes over, I'm vacuuming monkey hairs for hours at a time and you don't see me freaking out! Fuck this! Mm, looks like they didn't go easy on you. These articles are total slander. The truth is, I've already had at least 12 gazillion kids' birthday parties cancel on me. They shut down my Facebook. That's not very nice. Yes, but these accusations are quite serious. Listen, you have to put it into context. It was the 70s, right? We weren't such prudes. Values were different. We were just having fun. No, of course. 
Are you all right, Mr. Obiselix? Somehow you seem a little different today. You know, I'm trying to cut down on the magic potion a little. Great! It's uh, because of this girl. She's not into guys with uh, addiction issues. <laughs> It's just like that you decide to throw away tradition? Hmm? And did you think to tell your mm. body? Well, you know, you might also want to consider, you know, because... Because what? Consider my ass! Can't you see what it's doing to him? Oh, whatever. Come on, they're all adults now, so what does it matter, huh? <laughs> Falbaba is a whore! Hey, you know what else? I heard some of the things she's been saying about you. Really? What did she say? Oh, you're not going to like it, buddy, but I Tell know. Tell me what the hell she said! Chill already! She thinks you're a little too fat. <laughs> Wanna hit? Please, oh, officer, boy. open the door. <laughs> we know you're in there. Oh, my gosh. What a mess open this up. is. And it isn't Come very on. nice. <laughs> oh, fuck. It was open. Well, what the hell did you expect? You cannot trust chicks, you know, but your friends? <laughs> your friends always know what's good for you. <laughs> Look at you, all fucked up. Up with this crap immediately. I was notified that you were using illegal steroids on the animals. No, but you don't understand, lady. I'm telling you, it's all part of the Pokeball trainer's job and shit. Yeah. It's a thing, and you either get it or you don't, lady. Yeah, yeah. All right, let me show you what I mean. Just a second. Here, see, this is called a butt sucker. It's beautiful, right, ma'am? So my butt sucker has reached maturity. I can tell because I got the eye, and he's asking me for something. This one, he wants to evolve to the next level. So yeah. my job, what I do is just give him a little push like this. See? <laughs> then, then, pow, the butt sucker becomes butt muncher. <gasps> oh, good lord. But that's not all. If your butt muncher fights good, he can evolve more. You can make him a ball cruncher. Yeah. Mr. Sashat, you are going to do me the courtesy of ceasing your barbaric activities. I don't think so, miss. I told you that I won't be bullied. This is an ancient tradition, a noble art in which the animal and trainer become one. It has nothing to do with barbarity and shit. Come on, Bud Mojo, get in your Pokeball. Come on! Get in there, you piece of shit, before I get you! Oh, shit. How can I help you, sir? Never put your fingers near the door. They might get pinched very hard. <laughs> Never put your nipples in the stapler. You might get them pinched very, very hard. Ah, yes, that can be painful. Never put your testicles in the mouse trap. Okay, that's enough. Take your nasty business somewhere else. That's enough, I said. Who's your daddy now? Who's your daddy now, bitch? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I can't move. Uh, I can't move. <laughs>